Xpeng has been teasing us with an electric flying car now for a few years. To be honest, I thought it was vaporware. I thought it was fake. Uh, it was like a project, a little hobby project. It would never really happen. Or would it? Well, people have seen it driving on roads. What's next? Can it fly? I think maybe it actually can. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel on the Electric Viking. Great to see you. I'm coming to you here from Melbourne, Australia on a nice chilly morning. You know what? I can't complain about being cold. I know it never really gets that cold in Australia compared to Northern Europe, compared to North America, Canada, Alaska. You know, a lot of you guys living in what places like Finland, Norway. Yeah, it doesn't get cold here. So I'm very grateful for that. Speaking of cold and EVs, I just did a video on an electric vehicle test on 31 different cars on their actual range when it's minus 10 degrees. Incredibly, range decrease over what they're expected to get wasn't very much different. Big improvements recently. Getting back to the flying Xpeng electric car. If you're a certain age, you've been waiting for your flying car for a long, long time. I mean, the Jetsons, yeah, ring a bell. There's been a whole lot of flying car concepts over the years. A whole lot of people have teased us with these ideas nothing's ever really happened. Now this Xpeng flying car is backed by massive Alibaba. They're kind of like the, the Google of China or maybe the Amazon of China, depending on how you look at the company. Now last month, Xpeng delivered 16,000 electric cars in that month alone, making them one of the biggest electric car manufacturers in the world. And they've actually presented five different versions of their flying car vehicle concept since all the way back in 2016. Most of those cars looked a little bit like drones with seats in them, but this is a whole different thing altogether. This sixth generation version looks much more like a car or like what a flying car would look like. Well, at least what I would imagine one would look like anyway. Now, what it looks like to me is this is actually an Xpeng P7 and it's been converted into an electric or flying version. The front wheels have been moved forward, giving it a much longer wheelbase and the car's shock absorbers are much bigger, allowing for it to land. Now, Clean Technica says that beyond that, the spy shots show a large casing on the roof to hold in the rotors when they're not in use. This makes a lot of sense because one of the challenges of designing a flying car or a driving drone like this would be locking the rotors properly to prevent damage to them when you're driving, which would explain the heavy duty top box. So there's news reports all over China that this thing actually can fly. I don't know what you think. Do you think it's possible? Do you think this thing can fly right now? Or is this just some kind of game and a little bit of fun and just a pipe dream? Now, I personally think they're real and they really exist, but I don't know when that's going to be. Now, considering China in some ways can actually be very quick to regulate things, very quick to allow things to actually go ahead, like autonomous cars, actually are driving around in China right now that people don't even know about. I think it's possible one of these could be seen flying around in China's skies by the end of this decade, or maybe within the next five years even. But it's probably going to take 10 to 20 years to actually see them flying around in other countries like America, Australia, England, you know, other European countries. See, my question is here, if you had one of these, do you need both a driver's license for a car and a pilot's license to drive one of them? Or do you only need one? Or do you need both? I'm not really sure how this is going to work, but it's kind of interesting to think about. And honestly, didn't we all dream about this as kids, right? Flying cars, going around everywhere. We thought that would be the future. I mean, it hasn't happened yet, but it still could. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Have a great day.